Hey, hey, beautiful babes, your girl, Sweet Angel here. Welcome back to the channel, Life with Sweet Angel. Y'all, today I'm going to be doing a foundation review, so stay tuned for that. Before we get started, please make sure you join the family. That's right, my beautiful babe brigade. Hit the subscribe button, tap the post notification bell, and you'll be in the know each and every time I upload to the channel. I'm going to start off today, I'm actually going to put this setting spray. This is the Art Naturals Matte Finish Setting Spray that I'm using today. Instead of my normal primer, I'm going to use it to put on as a base before I apply the foundation. Today's foundation is going to be the NYX Foundation, the new Can't Stop, Won't Stop Full Coverage Foundation. Well, I can't say new. It's probably over a year old now, but it's new to me. Can't Stop, Won't Stop Full Coverage Foundation. Everybody's been hyping about it. It's one of the best selling foundations that NYX has ever released. And I am in the shade of Warm Honey. Yeah, so I just wanted to share my thoughts on it. I am one who really don't venture into getting new foundations much. I stick and stay with my usual, but today I wanted to share this one with you. This is overall my really first full impression of the foundation. Um, I did test it out on a portion of my face one day, but not overall all day wear. I'm doing that today. So let me just share with you what they proclaim this foundation does okay now it retails for $15 and it's been getting some really high ratings um, this is what it says shockingly lightweight waterproof and pigmented uh-huh can't stop won't stop full coverage foundation is our full coverage classic foundation that hustles as hard as you do this comfy long-wearing waterproof liquid comes in a wide range of flattering tones that don't transfer every creamy liquid shade glides on smooth delivering matte coverage that stays true up to 24 hours this overachiever also works to control shine and mattify your complexion all day long but it doesn't stop there this classic foundation is non-comedogenic and suitable for normal, oily, combination, and sensitive skin types. Well, it says a lot. Now, I have mature skin, so that was my biggest concern. Is it going to work for me? Well, they tell you how to use it and so forth. Um, now, I applied mine with a sponge. It does say here, after prepping face with Can't Stop, Won't Stop Matte Primer, which I did not use, apply and blend foundation using our total control drop foundation brush pro flat foundation brush complete control blending sponge or your fingers so i used my sponge not theirs but this real technique one so but it applied nicely to my skin i was just admiring how it really did go on pretty smooth I only really applied one full layer of this and for the most part it did give me a nice finish um, there was only just a few spots where I had to just put it on a little bit more a second layer which was more or less my upper lip and on the left side of my face I did have a few uh, little blemishes that I was just trying to cover up not really even blemishes but I guess you can say um, a little mole that I have on the side of my face I did want to see if it would actually cover that up now overall I really like the application of the foundation that really really did go on well I like the way that it laid on my skin a lot of times when you're talking about matte foundations and older skin it'll make your skin look uh, a lot drier uh, and will actually define the fine lines even more but this one did not do that so I was really impressed by that and I was super glad to see they have 
45 shades, which, hey, that means from the lightest to the darkest, you should be able to find a shade that works for you well. My shade that I chose worked pretty well, maybe just a little bit hair darker than I am right now because of the fact that, you know, my tan has kind of faded away. But other than that, I think it worked perfectly on camera. It looks great, um, but it does make my skin look a little bit more warmer than it is, but which to me makes my skin look healthy. So I think, I think I did it right. I think I did it perfectly. But if you can look here on the video, you'll see that there is a little bit of difference between my neck and my bottom jawline there. But other than that, I really do like the foundation. I think it'll work well for older skin. I really did not have to do any setting, which I didn't do any setting at all. So I think it worked out very well. Of course, it comes in a glass bottle. It has a pump, all the bells and whistles that we love in a foundation package. And that made me so happy. I was just taking some pictures of me with it on just to see how it worked out for my particular skin. And overall, the coverage was super nice. Now, after 10 hours, I came back later that evening just to show y'all what it looked like on me after 10 hours. And this is me with the flash on. And as you can see now, you see my smile lines, no major indentions there. I like that. It did not settle in the fine lines like you normally would have certain foundations do, but this is a matte. Now there was a little bit of, at the end of the day, of course, a little bit of um, shine that came to the face, which is natural that your normal oils are going to just rise to the surface. That's normal. But overall, I give this foundation a thumbs up. They definitely have a good one here. Great job, NYX. And I think this is in collaboration with Alyssa Ashley. So girl, y'all did that and I love it. If you enjoyed the video, if you enjoyed the review, if you're going to try this foundation, give this video a thumbs up. Drop me some comments down below if you've already tried it. Let us know your thoughts regarding this foundation. I'm your girl, Sweet Angel, signing out for now, but I'll see you on the next video. But in the meantime, please go ahead and put a like on this video. Give me a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you have not. Tap that post notification bell so you'll be notified the next time I upload. And I will see you, beautiful babes, on the next video. And please, share your girl with your world. Doodles!